After preparing the surface by sanding with 220, we want to use a lint-free cloth and some denatured alcohol, making sure to remove all the dust from the surface. Mixing the product on a one-to-one -one ratio using Stone Coat Countertops Countertop Epoxy, we mix it thoroughly either using a drill with a paddle or a regular stir stick for at least two minutes. After placing it on the surface, we're gonna use a shower squeegee. We're gonna move it around. Remember, this is a skim coat. So one ounce per square foot is more than enough product to make sure that you're covering your product with the required amount. For the edges, just take a gloved hand getting what's left over in the bucket or whatever is dripped off the edges. You wanna make sure you get proper coverage on all the sides. And then after that, grab yourself a torch or a heat gun and you're gonna to torch at 15 minutes, 30 minutes, and 45 minutes respectfully to remove those bubbles. Remember, this doesn't need to be a perfect coat. There are gonna be some leftover areas because we're gonna do three of these coats before we do that final flood coat of three ounces per square foot. Hope you guys are having a great day and look forward to seeing you next time.